Good afternoon. It's February 6, 2020. This is for my associate, the Viacom V of Doom. Who thought that, his little rebellious post was cute. And for all you bosses out there who think you're, you know, employees, don't post bad things on Facebook. Well, I wanna read you one, I took off my employee's Facebook wall. And he thought he was being smart by, blocking me, from being able to see it. Viacom V of Doom, you were grounded for about three months, for doing something very sim, emular to this. And I would have thought, with a boss, who works with IT for a living, you'd have better sense to do it again. But I just spent about six hours yesterday, fixing your computer for you, upgrading it for you, spent about $130 on software. And today, I ran across a post on your Facebook page, you thought I'd never be able to see. So, since you want to hide it from everyone, I'm gonna share it with everybody. This is called, to my boss by the way. To my boss. I'm not your damn slave. It's not my response so, to ability to clean up your shit. We have a cleaning lady for a reason. Her name is Janet, not Viacom. If you want coffee, get off your ass and make it yourself. If you want your parking lot sealed, put down the sealer yourself. Don't sit back on your ass, and watch me do it. If you walk into the studio, and get mud all over the studio, that I just cleaned, be my guest. But clean it up after you're done getting shit everywhere. I'm tired of picking up after you. You tell me at least once a day, that I need to quit drinking. Ha. Huh. I love this part. You could just pay me for all the shit that I do around the studio. Seriously. Are you kidding me? I'll get to that in a minute. Every day when I get to work, I have to do dishes, clean the countertops, all the floors, make all the beds, do the laundry, and take out the trash. I'm not even gonna mention all the work I do around your office. And if I don't do all that every day, I get grounded. You know how hard it is to keep up with chores and work? It's freaking crazy. I go to sleep at 10 every night, because I'm too tired to stay up any longer, and do anything else. I have to get up at 5 in the morning, to get ready for work. On the weekends, I have to sleep with my door locked, so the Silver Deke logo, won't get me up at 6. That part's true. This is all true. This is what, he's saying. And I'm tired of all, I'm tired of this bullshit. Next time I have to pour a cup of coffee, I'm gonna flip shit. I have no idea, how I have a life. I'm gonna hate to see the day, when you get too old, to wipe your ass, and you call me, asking for help. I won't be there. Signed, your pissed employee, Vernon. A.K.A., the Viacom V of Doom. I wanna address a couple of these. We have a lady that cleans the studio for us, as a favor to treat, ah, ah, awesome services. She is not, and you will never refer to her again, as a cleaning lady. Janet works harder in one day, than you ever have in your life. Pay you. For chores. Seriously. Pay you for chores, that you're supposed to do around the studio. You come to work every day, and you have a list of chores up on the wall, because you're too damn drunk to remember them. They are. Um, sweep the studio and kitchen floor, which, total would take you about, three minutes. If the countertops are dirty, wipe them down. Which takes about a minute. If the dishwasher is full, and been run, empty it. And put the dishes away. If it's not, just be sure all the glasses and shit, are in the dishwasher. If you have any laundry of your own, do it. And if your bed is unmade, do it. You don't have to do my laundry, you don't have to do my bed. You don't have to make the guest bed. 
you have to make your own bed. Well, I guess when the evil globe comes by, you have to make the guest bed. But um, pay you for chores? Are you out of your mind? You are 43 going on 44 years old. You want new things for your laptop? You want a new battery you want a new cord you want a new camera you want a new phone you want a new iPad. But you won't get off your drunk ass, to even, to even do your job. The only Alcoholics Anonymous clinic, that you've applied to, is the one I've made you apply to, because, I got the application for you. And you were too drunk to even carry that back. When I was a teenager, I went to college, while in high school, went to church, was a community volunteer, worked as a press box manager, for Friday night football games, at the high school I graduated at, and still had time to do stuff. Your responsibilities include, waking up on time, and getting your ass to work on time. That's the end of your response sought, to ability each day. You don't have that hard a life. But you're about to. I warned you months ago, about uh, what would happen, if you did something like this on Facebook again? The last time you were grounded, and quite frankly, I can't remember now, but it was for something, fairly childish and stupid. We took away the computer. That kind of thing. No cell phone, no Facebook. Um, and I told you that if it ever happened again, that it'd be a lot worse. And I was really close, to putting a bullet in your laptop that day. Now. This time, I just spent all day yesterday, blew half my day, upgrading your laptop, putting new software on it, um, spent about $130, in software, to get, eh, 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 everything ready, you know, the, the way that you want to have it, for work. You don't have to worry about buying a new laptop battery, you don't have to worry about buying a new power cord you don't have to worry about buying a new camera. Cause you won't be using any of them. Till probably retirement. Um. I don't know how to say, how disappointed I am in you, and how disrespectful, you were. To every single adult in your life. But boy. You got it easy. Way easy. It's about to get harder. It's about to get a whole lot harder. Today. Cause you're not gonna see this, and for all I know, you might not ever see it. But as soon as I'm done, I'm gonna post this, on your Facebook wall, for all those other drunk logos, who thought it was cool, for how rebellious you were, can see what happens. And all the other corporate bosses, may get an idea, to to to, to put a boot up their own employees ass. Because all this. There was more curse words in that one post, just. Ridiculous. Not happening. Disrespectful to me, Diane, Janet, Deke, your friends, and yourself. So, I'm gonna put a stop to it. That right there is your laptop. You can see it's over here on the ground. This right here, is my 45. That was the first round. These are exploding hall, hollow point rounds. From a, oh yeah, you have to pay me back for these two, cause these are about, a dollar a piece. One, two, three, four, five, six, oh yeah. And after that comment you made about Diane, she told me to put one in there from her too, so. That one's from her. And if I've got one left? I've got two left. Now I'm out. So. Just for the record. Whenever you're not grounded, 
whatever year that happens to be, you can have a new laptop when you buy a new laptop. And when you pay me back the $130 I spent on yours yesterday. Hope you've enjoyed your little fiasco on Facebook. Hope it was worth all this. Um. Have a nice day.